Hidden Object Guru here with Hot New Game God Strike, and I just want to quickly show you something. So I'm going to ask you something right now. Is it just my TV or is it almost impossible to tell which of these options I've selected right now? It's like the uh, two options are unbelievably uh, dim white and then slightly less unbelievably dim white. It's not great. Twitch integration? Not on Twitch. Oh. Cool. Anyway, uh, let's do this. I've heard... Well, heard. I've seen, based on screenshots, that this seems like some kind of a bullet hell game. But about, you know, fighting awesome bosses in a dungeon. That seems cool to me, so let's give it a go. Okay. Hopefully we'll find out what they survived. Okay, kind of weird that there's no reading this, but sure. <clears throat> and before the mountains rose high above the sky, a being with the power of a thousand suns gave its color to the world. It created life, eternal beauty, which had to be controlled. Thus its power was split into seven herald masks. Their duty was to find a living vessel who could channel their immense power. Wood channel, sorry. Each and all of them found their bearer. So it's a Green Lantern type situation, gotcha. <gasps> oh no! Offering their time in exchange for peace. What do you mean, offering their time? Like the time you spent worshipping? Oh no! Never trust greedy, sentient masks, people. What? Damn. Guy's jasoned up a storm. And so the last mask will have to depose him? Hopefully. The tribes of Ionora had no choice but to unite. You missed an uh, apostrophe in there with heralds. They sealed the rogue herald within an ancient temple, built upon timeless soils. Peace reigned during thousands of years, while the other heralds battled far away. However, a mysterious corruption started surging from the depths. Soil, vegetation, and people began to die. Oh, damn, so its corruption can spread. Well, that's Roof. And take the fight to that jerk. Mm -hmm. Turns out, ironically, it was just that the mask was made of uranium and it was poisoning the groundwater. Who knew? I'm kidding, of course. Ooh, nice. Oh no! It killed the wind? But wait, how did she get to the island if it killed the wind? Oars. Aww. Hopeless for her unsuccessful voyage? What does that mean? I love it when Brian cyan lights burst through the sky. That's how most superhero movies end. Uh-oh. Oh, I see. Time is both life and currency. You can buy abilities here. All right. All right. Nice. Way to go, Talal. I actually know someone named Talal. How do I uh, buy it? Oh, there we go. I have to choose what button it's going to go on. All right. Left bumper. Use souls. Collect souls to use spells. Text drain your time. Time ends, you become vulnerable, you have one last hit. Alright, let's do this. That's a cute premise. Four minutes and fifty seconds. No, I'm good. Uh, sure. What's this one? No cost, nice. Oh, can't wait to try it out. 
All right, Talal, let's do this. I don't think that's unfortunate. I think you just have a bad attitude. If we could fix that, you'd be fine, right? Whoa! You were not kidding about, uh... Wait, did I not get... Oh! I don't have any, uh... Charges. What? The charges fly off of him. Whoa, that was close. Nice. Sadly, I don't think I can stack charges. Maybe later, though. Sorry, pal. So is this just a boss rush? Or will we do... We'll, um, let me try words instead. Is this just a boss rush? Or will we be trying, you know, like, regular levels later? I'm fine either way. I'm just curious. Damn. So that's wave one. And he's going to have a new set of moves with every wave. Oh no, I've lost my protective spheres. Oh, that is not good. See, I thought I could teleport through that without taking damage, and I was wrong. Okay, I love that I lose a bit of, uh... Uh-oh. Thank you. Time every time I get hit. It's not like a Titan Souls situation where it's... Not one hit, then you're done. Dude. You thought you were all that. But really. You were just the guy I had to kill to start my day. Whoa. Whoa. Kind of unfair to do that. What? Uh, when you're stuck in a corner, dude. Wait a minute. This guy's just unfair generally. Okay, well, also I'm not good at this, so that factors in, obviously. Come on, Hoguru! Yeah, I'm not beating this tutorial, boss, everybody. <laughs> At least I correctly escaped once. Can I earn a little time back by beating his uh, second mode? Or no, definitely not. Definitely. Oh, he looks real mad this time. Now we're gonna get the surrounding beam that I've been waiting for. Come on, dude. Get it together. What? Two attacks at once? You know that's basically immoral, right? Ah! Has the action slowed down now that I'm on my last hit? Because it kind of seems like it. Okay, not a problem. I mean, it absolutely is a problem. I just want to do a little more damage. Can we... Can we talk about that? He's taking a little more damage. Come on. What? Apparently I got him without dying. That was not like me at all. Uh, a portal for me to step through. That would be wonderful. I didn't actually have to do it? Nice. What a singularity beam. Spiked boy? Tell me more. Oh, wow. Yes, please. I need four energy to do it. Well, it's going to be worth time. Nice. Oh, this is cool. We believe it's... Yeah, this is largely gibberish. But I don't care. I'm enjoying myself. What... It's an evil totem pole, everyone. What is happening? Oh my golly. What are the rules, Hogaru? Do not pay attention to the ow target. Only pay attention to the bullets. The target can work itself out. The same is true of literally any uh, 
bullet hell game. All right, can I use it? All right, let's try it out. What? I mean, I know he's got three lot, four lives. Oh no! I don't know, maybe only three. Do I get to become uh, friends with the last level of him? Because that would be very entertaining. Well, that's not doing the damage I hoped it would the second time, but... What? Those kind of look like beehives he's throwing at me. Okay, not beehives, per se. Don't know why I said... Like, bee... Sorry, bee stripes. On a bocce ball. Oh, level two. Here we go. Do I have the beam ready to go? What is happening? No, no. And then I got hit twice. Oh, screw you, game! Okay, not a problem. Making my getaway. No, he has four lives. I don't know what I was thinking. Wow, I got down to zero health real fast. Alright, let's try this again, shall we? And I know it was actually zero time I got down to, but I'm not going to keep referring to time and health again. Like, you all hopefully know exactly what I mean when I say the wrong thing. Already taken two hits. Three hits, four hits. This is not going well. What? Come on! Oguru, oh, it might just be that you're bad at bullet hell games. What's that? That's something you've always known? Like it is not information that you were bad at... New information that you were bad at bullet hell games? Oh. It would be good if I could skip that once I'd already seen it once. And it's a cute animation, but do I need to see it every time? Can he hit me when I'm doing that? Because if he can hit me when I'm doing that, I should reassess when I want to do that. Come on! Now, here we go. Right now, between attacks. That's the right time. And now the one that uh, clowned me so effectively. Come on, just die already. Oh, this is such a cool... No! Stop purposefully running into things, Hoguru. I know you're not purposefully doing it, you're just bad at this, but... Oh, damn! That was really bad at this. Well, I'm down to my last life again. <laughs> what? That dude crushed me. I have no confidence that I'm going to get past the last wave on one life like I did last time. See? So difficult dodging and the shield. That, as the kids say, is a real mess. Okay. Come on, Hoguru. Get better at dodging. I really thought I had charged up my super move, but I had not. No! I walked right into that. Oh yeah, you can get hit while you're doing the super beam. I thought because it was a super beam I wouldn't be able to be damaged by it, but I was completely wrong. Maybe save the super beam to that uh, third wave when I know I can use it without being hurt too much. Hopefully at some point I get a, uh, one of those that lets me quote-unquote heal myself. Dude! Get better at this. Alright. This is my time. And then he took hits in me- three hits in the same wave of shots. Had I just stood in place, I would have only been hit once. That's how questionable my game playing is. Come on, start draining him back in, then I will do one of these. Well, that didn't work. Oh, wow, this is not going well, everybody. As I'm sure you can see, 12, 11, yeah, it's over. 
I might be able to beat this wave, but as sure as heck fi, I'm not getting that next wave. That does feel really good, though. <laughs> Using the particle beam. Yeah, it's over. Anyway, uh, I'll try this again. In fact, I'm going to keep trying this. It's a really cool game. It is absolutely the kind of thing I love. It's one of those things where, like, I adore bullet hell games. I love the stylized visuals. I love the elaborate bosses. Like, there's very little about the genre of bullet hell that I don't enjoy. Other than the fact that I'm bad at it. But you know what? If I let being bad at it keep me from playing a genre of video games, how many video games would I play? But am I only going to play Spelunky? Dude. Whew. That went okay. Not great. Ugh. Souls disappear so quickly. Dude. See, this is what I'm talking about. I do two. I keep getting hit by two from the same... What? Oguru, you got this. Or do you? Come on, this is happening. I would like that, please. Yes, beam is charged up for the next wave, which starts now. I hope you're enjoying watching me lose. Ah, as much as I'm enjoying losing. Which is more than I thought I would. Much like the evil earthworm Jim, I love failure. To which uh, the evil earthworm Jim would respond, Don't be so literal. That was a reference to the briefly quite popular Earthworm Jim cartoon of my childhood, which I'm on the record as adoring. And it's over. 30 seconds, Hoguru. Do you have this or do you not have this? Because if you don't have this, I need to know now. Okay. Timing-wise, that wasn't terrible. What? How am I supposed to react to that? Yeah, they got me. Alright, we'll give it one more try. I hope I can show you the next boss as well. It's weird, if I could just get out of this uh, first wave getting just utterly brutalized less, I might have a chance, because I do pretty well in the second and third waves. But I take a... I mean, but they take a while. And of course, time is life. Just like that famous magazine company. No? Okay. That might have been too obscure a reference. Since, uh... Life magazine no longer exists, as I understand it. Did I do that without getting hit? Like, I think I lost some of my revolving armor deals, but I, I don't think I got hit there. Eh, yeah, might be wishful thinking. What? So wait until he does the shoot the thing the other way. And that's when you smash him with your, uh energy beam. He's going to do it now. I mean, he didn't, but it still worked. Have I been hit at all yet? Again, not counting my beams. I might have gotten those through those two without getting hit. I feel like I'm usually around two minutes when I get to this level. Anyway, we'll see. Oh, so cool. I love this level. Stage, whatever you want to call it. He can turn around. Have I not seen that before? Or have I just not been paying attention? It's a six of one type situation. Me thinks. Oh, yes. No, I forgot to move away from him. It was going so well. Oh, the last time I got here, I had 33 seconds left. By here, I mean fighting the final phase. Now I have two full minutes. So that's like eight hits at 15 seconds a hit. Which it might not actually be 15 seconds a hit. It is 15 seconds a hit. Wow. I was paying attention. It's not like me at all. Come on! Oh, I'm just getting crushed by this dude. Which, you know, is what he's designed to do, but wow. Hoguru? I have one second left. 
and I got killed as hell. So I made it to the final stage with four times as much life as I normally have at that final stage. And I did noticeably a lot worse than I did the previous time. You know why? Overconfidence. Confidence will crush... Overconfidence will crush you every time. I, like, I hope the bosses stay at this level of cleverness and fun value, because this is a... These two bosses I fought so far have been great. Okay, well... Oh, we did it! wasn't ready. Two, three, four, five. Right? Dude, you just got clown. It was brutal. I'd feel sorry for you if you weren't an evil totem pole from beyond the moon. I'm assuming he's from beyond the moon originally. I mean, it is the, it is the force that created all existence. So I have to assume it's not, like, living between us and the moon. That wouldn't make any sense. Alright, and now is my moment. God, I love that. I just love how brutal it looks. You ask me, Hoguru, to name my favorite uh, super attack in any game, and it's always the power beam. It is invariably awesome power beam. Alright, longest time ever, Hoguru. You've got this. Or do you? I guess let's find out together. Okay. What? How was I not expecting that? I saw what was happening. So this is something I learned from people who I know who are better at this genre of game than I am. And the answer is, and you haven't seen me doing this because I forgot, the answer is always move as little as possible. Focus on dodging, yes, but don't run all over the map unless you have to. Move to the side, dodge when you have to, and just go for it. Overload. Reaper. Uh, okay. I told you to in Kona 4. Oh, that sounds awesome. Desperately want to try that. Hmm, probably shouldn't have bought both. Well, we'll see. Reaper. Now that's what I want. So one, two, three. Okay, so there's ten. We're getting one per. We started with one. So are there nine bosses? There might be nine bosses. Gorgeous, though. Mmm. The burners, you say. Dracul. So it's Dracula. We're fighting Dracula, but he's just a rib cage. It's kind of weird, actually. See, again, focus on moving the minimum amount possible. I can't wait to see what this guy, Cone, does. Okay, well, now he started cheating. I'm kidding. It's not cheating. He's just a jerk. Oh, no. Okay, that was insane. Yeah, this guy's not messing around, is he? I believe I need two more. No! Did I just fall into lava? The lava isn't even getting closer. I just made a mistake. Alright, let's see it. Damn. That was amazing. And that was it? No! No, that wasn't it. He has three lives, and... Now I fight him in a much bigger arena, which is kind of badass. Something tells me having that teleport jump ability would help a little. Okay, well that's just badass. Is it bad that I am now officially a fan of Dracul? What? Damn. This dude is not messing around. I love it. I mean, he killed me, but I still love it? Alright, so... Not that I know what he's doing. So remember, the waves will never, like, force me completely to one side or the other. Ugh! Ogaru? 
Just keep away from the waves as much as possible. Him randomly firing those other bullets in addition to the waves and the spread is... Well, it's borderline unfair. I'm kidding. This is not a game that worries about stuff like fairness. This is bullet hell. Dear developers, if you wanted to make some kind of bullet hell metroidvania, I would be very interested in that. Just putting that out there. Do you feel like you're getting crushed? Do you feel like all of the joy is disappearing from your life? Do you know what I can offer you, Dr. Skull? A way through. A way to feel better about yourself. I can offer you freedom. And what do you have to pay for this freedom? You might be surprised how reasonably priced it is. All I ask in exchange is your soul. So you have to destroy those rapid fire shooting skulls if you want them to stop shooting. I thought it was a timed thing, and that was based on nothing. And you saw the price of making assumptions. Kablamo. What? Uh, this has gotten real, as the kids say. Well, that didn't work. Oh, that couldn't have been a worse move on my part. Why can I not hurt him? Am I out of range? What is happening? I think I almost beat him. I mean, it's hard to say. This is a very tough fight, but I think I almost beat him. I wasn't looking at his health, which I probably should have been. Like... I felt like that was getting close, right? So now they're coming the other way. Now they're going back this way. <sighs> now they're going the other way. Okay, perfect. He's doing the shots, which means he's getting weak. Oh my god, no. I love that my giant uh, battering ram one doesn't disappear, though. That is, that is nice. I feel like the beam is not going to be useful on that last uh, phase of the dude. Maybe it's not that useful on this phase either? Alright, so as he summons the red skulls, they have to go, like, immediately. Okay, that was a mistake. Big tactical no-no there. I don't know how that beam didn't hit me, but I think heavens it didn't. I really do love that beam too much. I feel like I'm starting to rely on it more than I should. Alright, here come the shooters. Quickly execute them so this play field doesn't become too confusing. Those guys are out of range. I guess I knew that was a thing on some level, but, you know, I didn't at the same time. Here they come. Alright. Please die. Thank you. It's just me or should those guys always drop souls? This is over. This is over. This is over. This is... over. Whew! Okay, do your charge. Then I'm gonna clown you. Oh, good. That felt unfair. Okay, I did something stupid there. I tried using both of my powers at once. And instead of doing a quadruple beam, as I thought was going to happen... It cancelled my, uh, quadruple shot. Okay. And you gotta, you gotta play? You wanna play with me? Huh. Well, I've got three seconds left. Let's see how that goes for you. Pally boy. Quite well, actually. You have no complaints? Yeah, that sounds about right. <laughs> this is going so poorly. No! Alright, we'll try one more time, then I'll wrap up the video. But yeah, this game is kind of magnificent. Like, what a twist to put on a bullet hell. So satisfying. And it's got the, um, the key thing from all really good bullet hells. Which is, when I make them, like, when I die, it's generally, and this is just the first three bosses, obviously it could get stupidly unfair later. But generally, when I die, 
I know what I did wrong. And I learn to av uh, avoid that attack next time. I wasn't watching the... Uh... As you might have seen, I was obviously not watching the... Uh... Yeah, that's right. I'm feeding on you. My hatred is dining out on your pain. To use the vernacular, you're welcome. You've never been a victim before, have you, Dracul? Must be bracing to at long last be on the other side of this relationship. <laughs> you think you scare me? I pity you. For when I have killed your God King, by that point, I won't even remember your name. You are nothing but a tiny stop on the way to the destruction. Your entire, uh, sorry, a tiny pit stop on the path to the destruction of your entire species. And what will they say when they discover that you could have saved them? You could have stopped me here. You're too weak. No, Dracul. You will be remembered not as a terror, not as a conqueror. You will be remembered as a failure, a pitiable, pitiable beast whose name is only ever spoken with open contempt. I don't know what that was. I started going down a road based on my hatred of this guy, and it ended up in a weird story about. Ah, 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 come on, Hogaru. I'm just going to restart this. It's obviously going terribly. If you take a hit in this first wave, like, it's fine if you lose your shields, but if you take a hit in this first wave, seriously, just, just stop it. Back to one, as the kids say. Did the kids say back to one, Hogaru? No. I don't know any kids. Jesus. What? I'll be honest with you, Jakul. I've become terrified of my own fury. Yes. You thought you were done with me. Your pain was just beginning, Dracul. What, Dracul? What will your... What will your master say when I tell him of your screams of agony? When I describe to him the way you begged for your life? Begged me to spare you the ignominy. You are nothing. You were nothing. A nuisance to be ground underfoot like an insect. When I remember you, it will be no different than remembering. The time I crushed an ant underfoot.
A fleeting thought. Not even a footnote. In the story of my triumph. Think you can protect yourself with stones? <laughs> you fool! I am the rock against wish, which you're crushed. A very silly person. All right, so uh, what does true aim do? Enemies are locked on forcing. Oh, nice! That actually sounds really useful. I was very happy with this. Anyway, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. I'd like to thank you for coming on this journey with me. If you had a good time and you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that coming up. I really can move faster. Is that going to be a good idea, though? Uh, man, blah, 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 blah. Anyway, uh, yes, if you'd like to see more, there's buttons for that. Oh, he's a fake Mobius. He lost his eye somewhere. Get it? Lost his eye? Because he's the word Mobius. But with anyway, you know what? It's clear what I was getting at. Uh, anyway, I've been the Hidden Object Guru. We already did this bit. Uh, there's buttons coming up. I'll see you back here for more new and upcoming games. But until then, I'm going to say that's right. Au revoir.